I'm Josh, a builder here in New Zealand, and I still have a mountain of landscaping. Let's just say sloping sides are a lot of work. Post concrete cleanup. We're going to do a little bit more landscaping, get the kids fought a little bit more safe, no, get it finished, get the balustrade up. Yeah, just chunking away at a lot of those little jobs that have been lingering and just really want to get it finished and out of my head. Yeah, this area is starting to look mint. Over lockdown, we've already used the skate pad. The kids have been down here with the chalk. I've been down here skateboarding. On the lawn here, they've been running around playing soccer. It's a lot of work, but we're getting there. So 
So this morning we got this floor squared. We're also doing some work up here on the driveway. What I'm gonna to do today is we're gonna fill up some of the planter boxes down the bottom. It's all those little things that take it from a building site to a finished product. It's crazy that it's taken this long to do it. Over here we've built like a little garden box and then just up there we're doing an edge. We're gonna carry the grizzolinias along. We're just going to do this feature area with a bunch of different size golf ball pittosporums. So they're kind of like staggered random and then when you walk up the drive you see that. We've got the firewood shed there and we've got the work from home office there. Boom, we've got a set of stairs from the top level to the bottom level. Almost ready. So much work in this kind of stuff. On a sloping site, it's so hard to work all this stuff out before you start building. Now I'll be able to drive straight up to my wood. Direct access to my wood. Yo, so you've seen it up to this point and I would love to stand here and say it's finished, but guess what? It is not actually done. But is it ever done? You know, the plants can always grow and there's always something you can add or change. Since I completed the build and moved in, the amount of time it's taken to not just do the landscaping, but to get my head around the landscaping, the mental energy that it sucks up. And my problem is, once I've got the vision, I just don't stop until that's existed. And we've got the skate ramp there and the trampoline there and the lawn there and the kids playground there. And we've got the deck up there. And we've got the rows of trees that I planted three years ago. Leave a comment below, tell me what your favorite part of watching this journey is. And honestly, if you're this far into the video and you haven't subscribed, what's going on? Hit that button, subscribe. You obviously like our content and there's heaps more coming.